Hi there, I'm Andrew. Welcome to Urban Rider, your number one destination for the world's finest riding gear. Time has flown by and it's already the 20th of March, which here in the UK officially represents the start of spring, which is slightly laughable given some of the snow outside. But regardless, the clocks are just about to change, which means longer days and warmer, better riding for everyone. 2018 is shaping up to be a fantastic year and there are so many wonderful events for your diary. You wanted to be sure that you didn't miss out on any of the fun. So here's our highlights of what you need to attend this riding season. Kicking things off is the Carol Nash Classic Bike Show on the 21st and 22nd of April in Stafford. This is a massive event with tons and tons of wonderful classic bikes to browse through, but also a huge auto jumble section, which is a great way for you to seek inspiration for that shed build you may have planned this year. For those of you local to us in London, May the 3rd sees the first Urban Rider Social of 2018 with an evening session over at Greenwich Market, where we'll be celebrating the launch of the AGV Legends Collection with a focus on all things Italian. You can come on your bike and you can bring and park it right Right in the middle of the market with it on show. There'll be loads of food and drink and it'll be a really lovely evening out. So do come along and stay tuned and subscribe to our newsletter where there'll be more info on that. So hopefully see you there. Fast forward to the end of May for the hotly anticipated bike shed motorcycle show at Tobacco Docks on the 25th to the 27th. If you can only make one event this year, make sure it's this one. It's a fantastic day out and it's really family friendly as well. So there's absolutely no excuse for not attending. 2018 show will feature over 200 of the world's most impressive custom motorcycles as well as an extensive range of all the finest gear and brands that support and make up our weird and wonderful little world. There's art on display, live music, great coffee, street food, cigar and whiskey lounges, and of course, the obligatory tattooist and barbershop. That same weekend sees the madness of the Isle of Man TT. And if you can't get there to see the action live, make sure you tune in to witness the skill and bravery on display as riders complete the 37 mile circuit, at average speeds of around 130 miles an hour. Bike racing doesn't get any more spectacular than this. June the 14th marks the start of the Wheels and Waves Festival in Biarritz. This is the perfect excuse for a weekend getaway to the south of France and to revel in everything fun and exciting about our motorcycle culture. And if you haven't been, you really should. There's stuff going on everywhere. There's hill climbs, enduro races, exhibitions, live music, surfing contests, and much, much more. And if any of that doesn't take your fancy, you can always just chill out on the beach and soak up some sun. Two weeks later is the UK's answer to Wheels and Waves with the Malay Mile. This is replacing the setting of Biarritz with a beautiful English manor house just outside of London. The Mile has been getting stronger every year, and it's a really wonderful eccentric mix of drag racing, hill climbs, trials, and even motorcycle polo. And there's a really nice friendly atmosphere, so whether you're obsessed with bikes or not, you're sure to have a great day out. The Malley boys know how to put on a show, and we'd strongly recommend you heading down for this one. And if you've got far to come, why not just spend the whole weekend and camp on site? For chopper enthusiasts, the Assembly Chopper Show runs on the 14th and 15th of July, featuring a massive collection of amazing custom builds at the House of Vans in London, a vibrant and eclectic location for this great event. At this point, you are permitted a couple of weeks rest, but make sure you're back in time for Dirtquake 7, starting on the 18th of August at the Arena Essex Raceway. Dirtquake is an absolute riot from start to finish with crazy racing taking part on the bank short track circuit. Immensely fun to watch all ride in and non-stop entertainment throughout. This is your chance to see what is faster out of a bobber, a cub, a flat track special bike or some shed built rust bucket. If you can't get there, you can also watch the highlights that'll be on ITV. By the time of the next event in our diary on the 24th of August in London, you may be permitted a little bit of downtime. So for those in the London area, the Fueled Moto Film Fest is your chance to relax and watch a series of independent shorts as well as feature length motorcycle films in a selection of intimate motorcycle themed venues. There's still way more we couldn't squeeze into this overview so go over to Urban Rider and sign up to our newsletter for more info on the above as well as chances to win free tickets to a number of the events. Follow us on Facebook if you'd like to join us for some laid back ride outs open to anyone on two wheels and we couldn't get away without mentioning the new season launch of our amazing brands. We have so much wonderful stuff coming from the likes of Bell Staff, Roland Sands, Dainese, Knox, Fuel, as well as some others that are top secret and we can't tell you about just yet. So make sure you subscribe to our channel for more reviews on the world's finest riding gear. So thanks for watching and have a great 2018.